Say hello to Lafayette senior Jerome Rudolph. He's a key member of the track and field team and he's a former running back of the football team. That's not all, but Rudolph does a much better job of introducing himself. I'm from Georgia. Everybody calls me country, because I am. You know, I like, I like uh, riding horses, fishing. A lot, lot, lot of things like that. I like working on cars, you know, just hanging with the friends and the usual stuff that everybody else does. He also runs fast, very fast. Heading into this weekend's Patriot League Outdoor Track and Field Championship, Rudolph holds the Patriot League's fastest times in the 100 and 200 meter dashes, and he's looking to run away with a pair of individual titles this weekend. I hope to go far as I can. You know, I want to compete nationals, be all American. You know, that's my goals. As um, far as the team goes, we would want in the win the Patriot League, compete at IC4A, you know, our four by one, we have aspirations to make it to the regional finals. So we're looking to do big things. Rudolph came to Lafayette with that goal in mind, but it was set for a different sport. Rudolph was recruited to play running back for the football team, and he did, amassing 1,029 total yards and eight total touchdowns in 17 games. He played three games during his junior year, but a concussion brought his season and inevitably his football career to an end. Yeah, it's unfortunate that football ended the way it did, but like people always say, once one door closes, two or three more doors open for you. So I was just uh, grateful that I was accepted on the track team and was able to compete some more. Since joining the track team, Rudolph has been a key part of the sprint events. He was a member of last year's 4x100 Patriot League Championship relay team, and he was the runner-up in the 60-meter dash at the Indoor Championships in February. This weekend at the Outdoor Track and Field Championship in Worcester, Massachusetts, Rudolph hopes to win gold in the 100 and 200, two events he trained hard for in the offseason. Well, I got to give thanks to my coach first and foremost and all my um, teammates who keep me motivated and push me to keep going. Uh, you know, this is my second year of participating in track and, you know, it took a little while to adjust to it coming from football, you know, doing both at the same time. But this year I had a, uh, pretty much a whole offseason to focus on track alone and I've develop my skills and my start and just having better endurance. His next all season will be spent gearing up for grad school. Rudolph plans to get a master's in business and return home to Georgia to help grow his father's business. My father has his own contracting business and he, his dreams and hopes is for me to come back and help expand his business so you know I've been prepping myself for that. Rudolph will compete in the 100 and 200 trials Friday afternoon with hopes of advancing to Saturday's finals. To keep track of the entire meet, log on to PatriotLeague.com throughout the weekend.